Oh, there you are. In this lesson, I mainly want to provide an introduction to the methods applied at hyperspectral remote sensing of soils. How do you actually get from air and spaceborne imagery, fielded lab data, to soil maps? You already know about the soil properties we are interested in and how to collect reference samples in the field. So, in this lesson, I will give a brief overview of the technical specifications of imaging spectroscopy data and some necessary pre-processing before we dive deeper into methodological aspects. You'll get an overview on which methods are generally applied in a soil spectroscopy context. These include, for instance, soil-specific pre-processing steps, such as the masking of pixels that mostly contain non-soil information, then we differentiate roughly between qualitative approaches that classify the composition of our data and quantitative approaches that actually allow the assessment of property abundances. Both methods have their advantages and disadvantages. As this course focuses on qualitative methods, we'll look at them in a bit more detail. Finally, in this lesson, we will set up a workflow on how to proceed from your research or real world question to data selection and acquisition to Ta-da! The final soil map product.